Good morning. Welcome to India Meteorological Department. Myself, Dr. M. Mahapatra, DG, India Meteorological Department. As all of us know, a depression formed in the morning of 28th October over the southwest Arabian Sea. It moved west northwestwards and intensified into cyclone storm in the morning of 21st October. Then it has moved west northwestward continuously and intensified rapidly into an extremely severe cyclone storm today at 3 UTC or 8.30 IST. And it is located here about 880 kilometers southeast of Al Qaeda in Yemen. As per our forecast track, you can see here, shown in the red line, along with the balloon, we are expecting this extremely severe cyclone storm to move northwestwards to maintain the intensity of extremely severe cyclone storm for the next 24 hours due to the favorable oceanic and atmospheric conditions. Thereafter, it is showing slightly weakening trend and it will cross Yemen and adjoining Oman coast between Al Qaeda and Salala port around noon of 24th October as a very severe cyclone storm with wind speed of 115 km per hour to 125 km per hour with gustiness 140 km per hour. So this is the expected point of landfall around noon of 24th or around 6 UTC of 24th October. And from this picture you can find out that the wind's distribution around the center of the cyclone which is located now over southeast Arabian Sea. And it shows that there could be the strong wind of about 100 kilometers from the center at the time of landfall on both the sides towards Yemen and Oman, and which has got the potential to cause the damage as it is a very severe cyclone storm. And this very severe cyclone storm, you can see from this animation, as it is moving towards west northwestwards, it is now very close to Socotra Island here. And thereafter, by today evening, it will just move across Socotra Island, keeping Socotra Island to the left, and then it will move towards Salala. As you can see now, under this influence of this cyclone, already cloud mass is approaching towards Yemen and Oman. The rainfall activity will start over Yemen and Oman by tomorrow morning, and heavy downpour is expected when cyclone will be crossing the coast. We should not be surprised if there is extremely heavy rainfall exceeding 30 centimeter in 24 hours over Yemen and adjoining Oman. Due to the cyclone, there could be the storm surge. We are expecting the tidal wave of about two meter height above the astronomical tide to inundate the low-lying areas of Yemen and adjoining Oman near the landfall point around the landfall time on 24th. We can also expect the wind speed of 115 to 125 km per hour, gusting 140 km per hour, to cause the structural damages, leading to breaking of trees, uprooting of electric poles and telephone poles, and structural damages over that region. As we are the regional specialized meteorological center, we are providing every three hour guidance to Oman and Yemen, giving the details of the current status of the cyclone and the forecast for next five days. We will continue to provide this information and guidance to all these countries till the cyclone dissipates over the land after the landfall. We are also providing information to all the shipping community through global maritime distress safety system and also the fishermen. We advise the fishermen not to venture into the area of southwest Arabian Sea and west central Arabian Sea. They should go away from this danger zone, the ships and the fishermen should be safe by avoiding this particular area. Because at present, the wind speed in this area is about 95 nautical miles per hour, or you can say about 185 kilometers per hour. At the same time, you can see that wave conditions are phenomenal. The wave height in the sea can be more than 14 meters, which is highly dangerous for any boats and ships in this region. So therefore, I appeal to all the fishermen, the shipping community, to take care and to avoid this dangerous zone to be safe from the cyclone test. Thank you.